Hello, in this episode I fixed my chaos time, I fixed my charms, and I did, and I tried to do a high level serpent, so yeah, let's get into it. The first thing I needed is a castle generosity charm. I managed to drop this in like two days, and I straight went it for tier 9s, I wanted as high tier fixes as possible, and then of course legendary. Cause this is my last chaos star that I'm gonna craft, unless I'm gonna switch the build, so I went for leggy. I was looking on my chaos star for more prefix rolls than suffixes, cause I, I really needed a critical rate, my critical rate is kinda low, but I couldn't wait any longer, I really needed to fix this, cause whenever you fix your chaos star, even if you lose a little bit of damage at the start, you can start grinding the correct charms. In my case, I needed some Mirror City charms and I needed Alyssa charms. But even before that, even before getting those charms to hit 4x140s, I went to test my damage. And it was solid 20% amp, or close to 20% amp, which was crazy considering that I don't even have all the correct blessings and all the correct charms. On another day, I managed to drop a Mirror City charm and I managed to drop a Lisa charm, so I went straight into upgrading those charms to equip those. And again, I got really lucky with my charms because I managed to roll another maximization chance. On Mirror City, I got Elemental Pen, which is not bad. Elemental Pen actually means a lot if it's flat. So I got 6, it's not bad. And on the Lissa Charm, I got Maximization Chance, which is insane damage increase. I equipped those, and my tooltip went into the moon, actually, how good it was. But yeah, I knew it immediately. However, I was still lacking a little bit of Mirror City Blessing, and the only way to fix it was actually to go and level up my Blessing effect. So basically, Charm upgrade slots. I forgot that I was not picking any blue charms, so I had to start picking up those. I did random leggy charm for the upgrade blessing and then I applied it and I was 140 exactly which right now I'm 4x140 of course I went straight again into training arena to check my damage again and this is where the scaling begins with maximization charm and now having 4x140 blessing my damage went to around 4.5 bill from 3.5 bill so it's around 20% damage jump or something in that order. And of course, I'm getting my damage. The first thing I do, I go and try to do high level serpents. So this one was 160. I wanted to do a high level one, but I wanted to test uh, how strong I am. So I started with 160. And by the looks of it, it was not that hard. But I knew that 161 is a much tougher nut to crack. So I just, I was playing safe. I'm still, I'm still on the hardcore. I didn't want to die. So after that one, I went into 161, and this is probably where I'm gonna stop. Cause I only managed to kill it once, and this is where my day two basically of progression ended. And right now, my goal is to do as many 161 serpents and to drop an axe or a scepter so I could craft my weapon. Why 161? Is because you can start rolling tier 14 affixes. On 160, you can only do tier 15. So this is basically a breakpoint for me. So yeah, GDs, thanks for watching and see you guys in the next episode.